Have you ever pondered the existence of a mirror universe? A realm where time runs backwards and the laws of physics stand on their heads? This isn't the stuff of science fiction, but rather a fascinating scientific theory. Picture this. During the Big Bang, not one, but two universes were birthed simultaneously. One is the universe we know and live in, made entirely of ordinary matter. The other is its mirror image, an anti-universe made purely of antimatter, following completely opposite time trajectories. The physical laws in this mirror universe are the antithesis of ours. Even the causal rate is reversed. The principle of increasing entropy, for instance, becomes a law of decreasing entropy. It's as if an unseen hand is rewinding the cosmic tape. Intriguing, isn't it? An entire universe that is a mirror image of our own. But how could this be possible? To understand this concept, we must delve into the realm of theoretical physics and the CPT theorem. Let's begin by breaking down the CPT theorem. CPT stands for charge symmetry, parity symmetry, and time reversal symmetry. The C, or charge symmetry, refers to the mutual symmetry of particles and antiparticles. Simply put, if we replace the positive and negative charges in particles, the laws of physics remain unaltered. Next is P, or parity symmetry. This is the property of a physical system that remains unchanged after a mirror reflection. Consider looking in a mirror. The physical laws within the mirror are identical to those outside the mirror. The only difference is that left and right are switched. Last but not least, we have T, which stands for time reversal symmetry. This implies that the likelihood of an event occurring in the forward and reverse directions is the same. For instance, if we break a cup, the reverse of that event would be the fragments reforming into a cup. Although this seems impossible at a macroscopic level due to the second law of thermodynamics, at a microscopic level, the probability of a motion occurring in both forward and reverse directions is equal. In other words, the laws of physics remain true even when the direction of time is reversed. The combination of these three symmetries is always conserved. There may be instances where one or two of these symmetries could be violated, but no simultaneous violation of all three symmetries has been found so far. This is the essence of the CPT theorem. If we flip the charge of all particles, mirror space, and run time backward simultaneously, the interactions of these particles will still be exactly the same. The laws of physics, it turns out, do not change even in the face of such radical transformations. So keeping in mind this CPT theorem, it seems plausible that a mirror universe could exist, doesn't it? Now armed with the knowledge of the CPT theorem, let's revisit our mirror universe. Imagine a reality where every particle's charge is opposite to ours. Imagine a timeline that runs backward from ours. This is the mirror universe, a theoretical concept born out of the CPT theorem. The idea is that this mirror universe is a perfect reflection of our own, but with a twist. In this universe, positive becomes negative, left becomes right, and most intriguingly, the future becomes the past. It's a world where the laws of physics remain unaltered, yet everything feels inside out and upside down. This mirror universe isn't just a product of wild imaginations, but rather a consequence of the CPT theorem's robustness. This theorem defines the fundamental symmetries of our universe, charge symmetry, parity symmetry, and time symmetry. Violating any one of these symmetries, let alone all three, is yet to be observed, reinforcing the possibility of this mirror universe's existence. But where does this mirror universe reside? The theory suggests that it was born out of the same Big Bang that gave birth to our universe some 13.8 billion years ago. In essence, it's a twin universe running parallel to ours, yet following an entirely different time trajectory. The implications of this theory are profound. If true, it challenges our understanding of time, space, and everything we know about our universe. It brings up questions about the nature of reality, the concept of time, and the very fabric of our existence. But before we get carried away, remember that this mirror universe is a theoretical concept. It's a possibility, not a certainty. The existence of this universe is yet to be empirically proven. And until it is, it remains a fascinating idea in the realm of theoretical physics. Perhaps the mirror universe isn't just a figment of our imaginations, but a theoretical possibility. And if it does exist, it opens up a whole new world of questions, doesn't it? Between the negative 36 and negative 32nd seconds of the universe's existence, a dramatic shift took place. 
the universe expanded at an unimaginable rate within a billionth of a billionth of a second. The scale of the universe ballooned by over 100 billion times. This sudden exponential growth is referred to as an explosion. The explosion theory was first brought to light by physicist Alangus in 1980. It was his work that helped explain the structure of the entire universe, the flatness of space, and the large-scale uniformity and homogeneity we observe today. This rapid expansion, known as the explosion, was proposed by physicist Alangus in 1980. But what if the universe as we know it is just one side of a mirror? This is the provocative question posed by the mirror universe theory, a theory that challenges the very foundations of the Big Bang model of the universe. According to this intriguing theory, there was no need for an inflationary period, that rapid expansion of the universe from a point of no size. Instead, our universe could have formed as a mirror image of another universe, a mirror universe, if you will. This mirror universe theory flips our understanding of cosmology on its head, suggesting a radically different origin of our universe. The implication of this theory is both fascinating and mind-boggling. It suggests the existence of a special kind of neutrino particles that are electrically neutral and interact with almost no visible matter. These neutrinos, elusive and difficult to detect, are omnipresent, passing through everything, even us, without any interaction. Intriguingly, all known neutrinos have only left-handed properties. However, a universe adhering to CPT symmetry would necessitate at least one spiral neutrino. This missing right-handed neutrino has eluded scientists for years. But according to the mirror universe theory, this elusive right neutrino could be the dark matter in the mirror universe. Its elusive nature aligns perfectly with the characteristics of dark matter, one of the greatest mysteries in modern cosmology. These elusive neutrinos could hold the key to our understanding of the universe. In the pursuit of knowledge, we continue to question, to explore and to challenge the known boundaries of our understanding. Neutrinos, invisible particles that pass through us every second, could be the missing link in our understanding of the universe. Let's delve into the world of these elusive entities. Neutrinos are electrically neutral particles with a rest mass that's close to zero. They're like cosmic phantoms interacting minimally with visible matter and can pass right through any object, even the Earth. Imagine that. Trillions of these particles are zipping through our bodies every second and we don't feel a thing. Now, what makes neutrinos even more intriguing is their quantum properties. All elementary particles except neutrinos have both left-handed and right-handed characteristics. But the three known types of neutrinos exhibit only left-handed properties. A universe that adheres to CPT symmetry, that's charge conjugation, parity transformation and time reversal, needs at least one spiraling neutrino. But where is this elusive right neutrino? Well, that's the billion dollar question. Some speculate that these right neutrinos could be hiding as dark matter in the mirror universe. Their elusive nature aligns with the elusive characteristics of dark matter a substance we know exists but have yet to detect directly. So, could these elusive right neutrinos be the answer to the mystery of dark matter? As we continue to unravel the secrets of the universe, only time will tell. What if the universe we live in is a universe of positive matter traveling from the future to the past? A fascinating concept, isn't it? It's a theory proposed by none other than the esteemed physicist Richard Feynman. He suggested that positive particles are essentially particles that move in a positive direction along the time axis. Now, think of antiparticles. They are particles that move in the opposite direction. This could mean that antimatter is fundamentally ordinary matter that's journeying from the future to the past. It's a mind-bending concept, one that could reshape our understanding of the universe and its myriad mysteries. Feynman's theory offers a fresh perspective a new lens through which we can view the cosmos and its intricate workings. It's a tantalizing hint of the countless secrets that the universe holds. In this ever-expanding universe of ours, the mysteries are as infinite as the cosmos itself. So keep asking, keep exploring, because who knows what we might discover next. Imagine for a moment a mirror universe to our own, where time doesn't just march forward, but dances back and forth. A universe of antimatter, born before the Big Bang, where galaxies and stars, even our mirror selves, exist in reverse. Yet these mirror selves we can never meet the moment positive and antimatter cross paths. They annihilate each other, releasing a burst of energy. 
In this mirror world, every action we take happens in reverse, creating an eerie dance of mirrored existence. The Big Bang wasn't a solo performance, but a duet between our universe and its antimatter counterpart. Picture this. Two dancers perfectly in sync, yet moving in opposite directions. One, our familiar universe, advancing with the forward flow of time. The other, an anti-universe, marching in reverse, where yesterday is tomorrow and tomorrow is yesterday. Imagine galaxies and stars, not of matter as we know it, but of antimatter, an almost mirror-like reflection of our universe, yet fundamentally distinct. Here, every action we take, every event that unfolds in our world, finds a mirrored counterpart in the anti-universe. Yet this mirror is not one we can reach out and touch, for if matter and antimatter were to meet, they would annihilate each other, releasing enormous amounts of energy. So we find ourselves in a cosmic ballet, each moment mirrored in reverse in the anti-universe. Just like a reflection in the water, each event in our universe has a reverse occurrence in the anti-universe. But what happens when positive meets negative, when matter meets antimatter? In the cosmic ballet of existence, these opposing forces don't simply collide, they annihilate. The result? A release of energy so immense it's beyond our comprehension. This dance of destruction and creation hints at the tantalizing possibility of a time-space reversal event lurking just beyond the borders of our universe. If our mirror selves were to meet, would it be a handshake or an explosion? With the dance of time and space, perhaps we may never know.